A U.S. Secret Service agent who was here for President Biden's visit to L.A. was robbed at gunpoint. Officials say the agent had just finished work when the armed robbery happened. Let's go live to Fox 11's Ed Laskos in Tustin tonight with the latest. Ed. And Marla, all of this going down in this quiet, upscale community. And if that's not enough, the neighbors now finding out that the one firing the gun shooting is a federal agent, a Secret Service agent. Watch. Gunfire in the affluent Tuscan Fields community off Edinger Ave. We now know it is an armed robbery and the target, a federal agent. The community here is really shocked. They're just really surprised because it's a very quiet neighborhood and nothing really happens here. You know, we get the occasional porch pirate. Only this is no porch pirate and the victim is no helpless neighbor. It is a U.S. Secret Service agent, a Secret Service agent robbed at gunpoint. We found out that it was like a Secret Service um, agent. It was like a shooting or something of that nature. That'd be crazy. Yeah, it's really, it was really strange, really crazy. And it gets even crazier. There is gunfire. The agent is the one who opens fire on the robber. I'm certainly glad it was him instead of me. At least he had the ability to take some defensive action. These orange cones now turn to evidence markers placed on the ground by the spent shell casings. Count them one, two, three, six of them at all. Definitely heard a lot of. Uh I thought it was fireworks because it's almost 4th of July. Yeah. And uh, it was maybe about five or six, I thought, shots that I heard. Not sure if the robber is hit, he grabs the agent's bag and then drives off in his getaway car. Here it is from nearby security cameras. It is a 200406 Silver Infinity FX35. The Secret Service now out confirming it is one of their agents, but not the ones assigned to the protection detail for President Biden's L.A. visit last Saturday. Instead, the agent involved in the shooting, off duty at the time, returning from an assignment. Still gunfire here and from a Fed, more than leaving its marks. Kind of puts us on edge a little bit, but obviously uh, we have caring neighbors here, and so we feel safe. You know, I think this is a one-off incident. Now, uh, that's what they're hoping. Another neighbor saying it's really a sign that something like this could happen anywhere doesn't make a difference, she said. So as the investigation goes on tonight, they are still trying to find that robber to see if he was hit by gunfire, to see if the agent was a good shot. They're also trying to find that getaway car. And the neighbors around here, as they say, just trying to catch their breath, hoping this won't happen again. For now, we're live here in Tustin. Back to the west side we go.